Now that the Sturgis rally is in the rearview mirror, it's time to start focusing on the state of South Dakota's roads. Federal money for the nation's highways and other transit projects will keep flowing, but only for another three months. The Senate initially passed a six-year-long bill, but the House refused to consider that funding, forcing a patchwork extension. The short-term measure means construction on the nation's highways will continue this summer, but that's only a quick fix. U.S. Senator John Thune says states like South Dakota need a long-term financial plan in order to create long-term solutions for our aging roads and bridges. But the problem with short-term extensions is you, you can't plan. You know, the people who have the, the state departments of transportation, the, the, the contractors, the construction, the people who build and, and maintain our roads, um, it's awfully hard to do that when you're doing things three months to six months at a time. And we've had since the last uh, highway bill elapsed, which was 2009 now, 34 short-term extensions to the highway bill. That is not a way to want, run a highway program. So we need a long-term bill. And the clock is ticking on October 29th. The money will run 